Fiona McIntosh of Essential Osteopathy. We're going to go through a postural exercise that it gives you an idea of how you should be standing and indeed sitting, obviously that's more applicable for the upper half of your body. So what you would do is you'd stand against the wall, so you're back to the wall, and we're going to just get a sense of lengthening through the back of the neck and through your spine. And we're going to just take up your chin back, so your head is against the wall, so chin is back and down. If you're not doing that, chin back against the wall. Now that is obviously not realistic for day to day, you know, for walking around the streets or just generally for, for functioning like this. So we're going to just take the chin, the head off the wall a little bit so it's, your ears are above your shoulders and your shoulders should be above your, your hips. So we're talking about the plumb line. So imagine the line coming down through, sideways on, through your ear that will be at the same level as your shoulder and at the same level front to back as your hip bone and then at the same level front to back as your, as your ankle. So we've just, we're standing so that our ears above our, our shoulders and our hips and our ankles, everything's aligned. Chin is down, back of the neck, neck is long. So what you can do then to sort of get a feel for where your shoulders should be is open up your arms like this and then keeping your shoulders where they are, just relax your hands down. So you see how that allows me to be upright and I'm not forcing my shoulders back like a soldier. I'm just in a nice kind of neutral position and everything is aligned. So the, everything is aligned along the plumb line, along the side of the body and also the shoulders are in line as well.